Hi, I hope everybody's doing well today. I'm gonna go, I really don't know what I'm doing yet, but you probably do from the title and the thumbnail and stuff. But um, I'm gonna, or <laughs> I already started by priming my eyes with the Too Faced Shadow Insurance. Now you're gonna be shocked because I'm not gonna start out with the um, James Charles palette. I might switch to it, we'll see. But I'm gonna start with the Divin palette. It's Aphrodite by Bad Habit. And I think they have some pretty cool like autumn -y colors in here, so we'll see. I'm gonna start, no, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna take a fluffy blending brush if I can find one. I swear I have one. There we go. And I'm gonna take Admire. I'm gonna just put it in my crease. Now I do know I wanna go for more of like a, I don't know what to call it, but I wanna like, just like a circle eye. I'm sure there's a, a term that I don't know, I'm sorry. But I don't wanna like wing it out or anything, I just want it to go like around. Just put it all over my eye, I guess. Why not? I'm going to take, um, hmm, I'm going to take Romance with a fat pencil brush and put it just in the crease. Okay, no, I'm not. I'm going to take Lust instead. take a fluffy blending brush again and blend. And guess what? <laughs> Let's go to the James Charles palette see what we can do. I'm not liking that palette right now. I do usually like it, it's just not working out for me right now. Let's take... Hmm, let's take a fluffy blending brush. I have the mini palette, so I have to use this thing. And we're gonna use Boutique. Try to keep it in the or in the crease, but it's okay, because I don't know what I'm doing. That's better. It's so much better already. Will I ever move on from this palette? Probably not. And I'm taking a different blending brush and I'm gonna go in, let me, let me see, with your kidding. It's very bright, I hope I don't make it, I think it's gonna be fine. In the crease too, but on the outer crease. Okay, awesome. So I just went and I cleaned up that fallout it was really bothering me and now I'm gonna take this liquid eyeshadow and flirty flirty birdie from elf and I'm just gonna put it on the bottom part in the inner corner go up a little but mostly I just want to tap it out now and try to stay away from the crease as much as I can and keep it towards the front. I know you probably can't hear this, but my it's till like 10 o'clock at night right now, and my my dogs are sleeping in my bed and they're snoring. It's sweet. <laughs> Yay. 
Okay. Now I'm going to take the e.l.f. eyeliner in Midnight and I'm going to just, um, I'm not going to do a wing or anything. I'm just going to put it on my, um, lash line. <laughs> you have to hold your breath for this. Gonna take a break from the eyes for a second and do my base. Anyway, for concealer, I'm gonna use the Instant Age Eraser by Maybelline in light. I'm gonna take my favorite, the Airspun Powder. Now just taking the Physician's Formula, like it's like a mini glow palette, but I'm gonna take the, that highlighter shade in here. It's called Beachy Peach. Wait, highlighter, I meant blush, <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm also going to take that highlighter shade in this palette. My skin just really isn't feeling it, man. Oh, well. Okay, we're going to go back to the eyes. I'm going to get a flat brush. All right, going back into the James Charles palette, I'm going to take your kidding. I know it's going to be bright, but. Put it under my eyes. Oh, I want to take a smaller blending brush. That doesn't have black on it. I'll take a really small, like, pencil brush, actually. Boutique. Boutique. Whatever. <laughs> Put it under our eyes. Blend it out. So I added some black eyeliner on my um waterline. Now I'm gonna use just the Maybelline Falsies mascara. I know I said in one of my videos when I was reviewing these eyelashes that I don't really like them, but we're gonna try them again. I'm gonna get, do them like off camera though, so I don't get frustrated. Okay, so I'm thinking, the glue is still drying. I'm thinking, I kind of messed up, but I think that, I think they look a little bit better with a bolder look. It's just the band is so thick. It's so hard. I don't know, whatever. Anyway, I'm gonna go in, <laughs> I'm gonna go in with the ColourPop, what is this? So Juicy Plumping Gloss. This one is in Roundabout. And I'm gonna put that on my lips. Not that much. <laughs> Ew, I don't like that. Let me go find something else. So instead <clears throat> of that, I'm gonna take the Butter Gloss or Butter Lipstick by NYX in the shade, wait, Ripe Berry. There's a cat hair on it. Ew. <laughs> a couple more things to finish up and then I'll be right back with the final look. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoy the finished look. 
Thank you for sticking around through all the, the trial and error. <laughs>